What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to Forza Horizon 5 here in the spring season of series number seven. Today we're gonna to be finishing out the feet or the weekly festival playlist, or at least what I'm going to be doing on it, and jumping into the weekly Forza Thought challenge as well as knocking out the weekly event lab. So let's go ahead and take a look at that. So the weekly forces on challenge has to deal around the uh, Myers Manx. And if you don't have it already, you can actually buy it in here from the force on shop. Um, but I do own it already. So we've got just to pull it out and drive it for our first one, our first chapter. Um, so we're going to do that and knock that one out. So jump in here. Myers. I have of two fours edition ones apparently. I don't know if this would count. I bet they would, but we're just gonna use the regular one for now. So any share codes that you see will be for the non Forza edition Myers Manx. So that one is done. Now we have to win on the Baja California trial. Trail, not trial. Um, so we're just gonna throw a tune on it just to make this a little bit faster of a process. Um, I like A-class, that sounds good to me. Um, so we're going to do Sanip's here. Um, actually, let's do Team Funk. So there's the share code 13309353030. And again, this is for the non Forza edition version of the Myers Manx. And it'll cost you about 65 grand. So use that with what you will. Got that done. So now we can go find the it's a dirt event um i think it's actually we did it in one of the seasonal championships yeah so right here uh just to the left of the volcano at the bottom um one of the seasonal championships actually has that or had it in there i think it was the one with the the buggies um so there we go baja california trail and we'll just start it out and of course you want to make sure you're using your Myers Manx. I don't know why they didn't put the current car at the front. Um, instead put recommended cars there. I feel like those should be to the right since you're going into it with whatever car you're driving. And it's probably the one you want to use, but nonetheless, we'll wait for this to load up here in just a sec. All right, so Baja California Trail in the Myers Manx. We're just gonna start it up get this knocked out really really quick hopefully and wow, we're racing a nice setup <laughs> uh, yeah. this is a dirt trial or dirt trail and we're racing a nice setup and they're currently beating us which is the embarrassing thing I guess there we go and a Morgan three-wheeler as well Woo, not looking <laughs> sorry through the Rela or the Reliant uh, up on its uh, two wheels, so but we're up in the first. We're just gonna kind of hoon around here and uh, you know, get through this race really quick. But just to conserve a little bit of time, let me just fast forward through this race and you guys here towards the finish. Dash to the finish line here. We are absolutely killing the drive guitars in this thing right now. A very good tune. Very fun off road. Just kind of hooning around. And there we go. Across the line in the Myers Manx. I didn't even see the, the drive guitars in that straightaway at all. So, kind of crazy. Let's see. We had a that seven second. Pretty, pretty crazy gap. So, there we go. That should complete that challenge, or that chapter of the challenge, as it does. And now we need to earn three kangaroo skills in the Dunas Blancas. And that is where? Up here, right? Yeah, so we just need to jump on the dunes, essentially. If we can do that, it's easy enough. 
Kangaroo is just consecutive air, I think. So you really just kind of want to get um, little jumps here. And I don't know the easiest way to do that. There's got to be some dunes that are set up to make it like that pretty easily. Maybe a little come back and forth, maybe. Nonetheless, we got that one done, and the last step here is just to earn two stars on the Dust Bowl Speed Wrap. I'm not really sure what that is. Oh, it's right here. Okay, so we need 100 miles an hour. Um, I think we'll be able to do that pretty easily. Let's jump over here. We just need two stars, and again, it's 100 miles an hour. Should be relatively easy to do. It going this way. Put it there. And there we go. Easy beast. Cross the line. And that should be over it. So that is the weekly Forzathon challenge. That one's easy enough. Last thing we have here is the Guanahano Racetrack uh, Seasonal Event Lab, and this will get us the Dunkervort GTO. And for this one, we need an S2 class Extreme Drac Toy. All right, so let's see what we've got here. Um, I'm just going to use just a random car that I've got. You really don't need to like have a tune for these, um, like any specific tune. Maybe we'll just use our M5. Or X5M. This is the Forza Edition one. This is the Forza Edition, like the stock tune on it. And I mean, these don't really matter that much. You just have to complete them, really. So we're just doing this to get this done um, and get that Donker Vort and get the points for the seasonal progression because that'll give us the 40 total that we need. So, all right, here we go. We're actually doing a race. So, Guanahano Racetrack. Usually the drive tars don't do too great on these uh, custom like event labs, so I'm not too worried about it. Yeah, like stuff like that happens where they hit the wall and stuff, so just kind of like mildly drifting up there. Sesto Elemento and dive into them, so there you go. Up into first, we've got five laps. Huh? That's interesting. Um, <laughs> so we'll do one complete lap, and then uh, I'll just jump through and the rest of those off. So you guys don't have to sit here and watch me go in circles. But you know, we'll definitely pop back in if anything fun and interesting does happen after we start. You know, skipping through. But yeah, it's not. I, I mean, I think these are cool. I wish you could set like how many lap had to do, but you know, we we'll just kind of put some time in and do these five laps, I guess. So. Definitely a well created track, kind of like you know, Monza kind of stuff where you're racing through a city and stuff like that. Um, for all of the F1 fans out there. Super excited about F1 2021, 2022, whatever it is. Um, 21, 22. I don't know. I can't remember which one it is now, but super excited about it. Um, I do have it pre ordered. I actually have a new uh, sim setup, sim racing setup, um, that I have got set up somewhat today. Uh, that I'm super excited to use. I think I'm going to be recording videos on F1, the new F1 game. I'm pretty certain it's 2022. But I'm not 100%. I mean, it makes sense that it'd be 2022. But nonetheless, 
Um, I've got a, a setup that I'm hoping to record some videos on um, for that and, you know, kind of integrate the setup a little bit into some Rise of the Game our videos. Uh, I'm not really sure how yet, but got a new wheel, got a new uh, actual cockpit. Uh, so looking forward to that. But nonetheless, we have surpassed our first lap. We've got four more to go. So I'm going to skip towards the end. I'll see you guys as we approach the finish line on that last lap. A couple seconds for you, but apparently it's going to be about 10 or so minutes it seems for me so see you guys here in a sec all right here we go i don't think i did a last lap but because it definitely said four out of five i thought but i could be mistaken but we will take it so there is the event lab Eight minutes, eight and a half minutes to get the Donkervort GTO. And we'll take 150,000 for our troubles. But there we go. I hope you guys did enjoy the video or found it helpful. If you did either, definitely leave a like on the video. Definitely get subscribed for future Forza Horizon 5 content just like this. The rest of the festival playlist has videos on it on the channel and they should be up and uh, out already so definitely go check those out if you are having issues with any of the uh, seasonal championships the trial event or the seasonal PR stunts but I hope you guys do have a great rest of your day and we will catch you next week in the summer season of series 8 I hope you guys have a good one